Let's make a white lady, a pre-prohibition cocktail that is delicious and essential to know if you want to start creating your own cocktails. Now, this is a shaken cocktail, so first things first, grab yourself a cocktail shaker. It's also a gin based cocktail, so grab yourself a bottle of gin. We're going to go in with 40 milliliters of gin, whatever your favourite gin is will do just fine. I prefer to use a London Dry, the original recipe calls for Plymouth Gin, but it's completely up to you. Who am I to tell you otherwise? Next up we're going to grab some lemon juice, the fresher the better, but whatever you can get your hands on in this current climate will be fine. And we're going to add 25 milliliters of lemon juice. Next up we're going to add just a splash of sugar syrup, we're going to add 10 milliliters. And if you don't know how to make this, it's just equal parts, sugar, warm water, stir it, dissolve the sugar, let it cool and you're good to go. Just add some more mouthfeel and it's easy mixability, easier than granulated sugar anyway. Lastly, we're going to add some orange liqueur, I'm using Cointreau, triple set works fine, you want something generally a little bit stronger and a little bit drier to really make this cocktail, really make those flavours pop. Optionally, at this point, you can use an egg white, that's just going to froth it up, that's just going to give it a light and airy texture, but that's completely up to you. I prefer just to add ice, like a savage, and give it a shake, as is, without the egg white. Now where I shake this, little fun fact for you, it is said to be named after F. Scott Fitzgerald's wife, that is Zelda Fitzgerald, who used to speak from the Savoy Bar, back in the 1920s, she had platinum blonde hair, so Harry Craddock is said to have named after her. Whether or not that story is true, who knows, but nevertheless it is an interesting story for a cocktail of an otherwise weird name. Now to garnish it you can use a lemon peel, however I do have some dried lemons on hand, I'm just going to add a little, little dried lemon. And there you have it, that is a white lady. Now it's perfect base for cocktail creating because the balance is already there, you can mix up the sugar syrup, mix up the the flavours of the liqueur to create your own interesting unique cocktail but that's the original so let's have a little taste see how it is delicious chef's kiss enjoy <laughs> 